نظر نظر The primary purpose of this convention is to enable every sincere individual to personally experience religious benefits. They may enhance their knowledge and due to their being blessed and enabled by Allah the Exalted, their perception of Allah may progress. Among its secondary benefits is that this congregational meeting together will promote mutual introduction among all brothers and it will strengthen the fraternal ties within this community. It is essential for all those who can afford to undertake the journey that they must come to attend this convention which embodies many blessed objectives. They should disregard minor inconveniences in the cause of Allah and His Prophet peace be upon him. Allah yields rewards to the sincere persons at every step of their way and no labor and hardship undertaken in His way ever goes to waste. I re-emphasize that you must not rank this convention in the same league as other ordinary human assemblies. This is a phenomenon that is based purely on divine help for the propagation of Islam. I conclude with the prayer that everyone who travels for attending this convention that is for the sake of Allah May Allah the Exalted be with them, reward them in abundant measure, have mercy on them, ease up for them their circumstances of hardship and anxiety, and eliminate their anguish and grief. May He grant them freedom from every single hardship and lay open for them the ways of achieving His cherished goals, and raise them up on the Day of Judgment among those of His servants who are the recipients of his blessings and mercy. May he be their guardian in their absence until after their journey comes to an end. O oh Allah, O oh Sublime One and Bestower of Bounties, the Ever Merciful and One who resolves all problems, do grant all these prayers and grant us victory over our opponents with scintillating signs because you alone have all the prowess and power. Amin. Amin.